Hi everybody, we're over here at 4767 18th Street, which is near Market, where it turns into Market and 18th. And we are gonna go take a look at this great single family house that's on the market now for 1495. One of the questions that we had is whether or not you can add a parking space. And it's interesting, when we go downstairs, you'll see that I would say the answer is maybe. You'd have to pick up the house a little bit, but there is good room around here. It's about five foot six on the other side, so if your pole ends right here. And so it might be possible, you never know, with the right amount of willpower, money, and time, and, and the such like that too. So one of our happy listing agents here. Hello, thank Hello, you for having us. So I know you guys are closing, so let's go here. So what they've done is really updated the property for sale. Um, and see how quiet it was. So double paint windows in the front, beautiful ooh, new fireplace and the floors have been redone. Great tall ceilings. I can't remember what the height was. I think there were, gosh, I can't remember. But it was a lot. I had the measurement somewhere. You got your formal dining room, the pocket doors here. Lovely, nice and charming. They're really, they work, they're great. You've got the curved and coat ceilings there. Ceiling height, let's measure it here. I'll we'll have a chance. Ceiling height here is nine foot nine he was taller than that but that's great because you have that sense of space and volume going over here i like this house because it's very deep a happy other other happy listening agent kevin so looking up here nice kitchen has been redone you've got a half bath full bath wow a full bath down here so that's really nice too um you're set back a little bit which is great nice new appliances and then you've got this little anteroom family room back here which is nice imagine some windows up here or whatnot and you've got a really beautiful yard as well take a look here really nice and serene once you get once you get back here uh, we leave just a few houses down so it's nice um i love this i think it's a conifer or some kind of or pine tree or who knows but take a look at that it's really pretty the yard is really nice as well it's nicely landscaped and it's about i think 30 feet from here this is five feet and the nice part here is we'll go take a look at the basement real quick while we still have a chance is that down here this little area is 11 feet but it's already within the footprint so arguably you could finish this off and it'd be nice but i am curious to down here this ceiling height here is about seven feet which is nice and then over here this is the front and one of the nice and impressive things is that they've actually really taken care of it. It is a trust sale, but um, you know, they've already reinforced the foundation, the beams and the posts look nice, they're in concrete piers, and we're all the way up to the front of the house, and it's about five feet, give or take, around here. So in theory, you know, you could open this up, perhaps you could add in um, garage parking down here. I mean, it wouldn't be the you know it wouldn't be the least expensive thing to do but it would be worth it if it's possible um, parking around here is decent nice hvac nice water heater that looks relatively new it looks like there's a sump pump there because you do have oops sorry i'll turn the off because you do have um slopage here but it does run down the hill let's go up here up here and we'll go back up into the main room uh, main areas and then you can see the upstairs as well um, the property was listed for a little while, and you know, as the holiday goes, nice new fences, by the way, too. Wow. Uh, so the holiday was uh, the holiday always slows things down. That's great. I'll take a look here. We'll go up real quick. Thank you. It's so impressive. We'll go through here, back through the dining room, like we said, back through the main part two, and we'll go upstairs. So I really like the upstairs here because it is really surprisingly deep so they've done a great job the floors look great you know the finishes are nice one bathroom over here one bathroom over there two rooms here first room here with Chewbacca C-3PO arguably a picture of Rafi and whatnot I like that little view out the back so you see the tree let's go over here and then you've got the other bedroom as well which is really spacious and nice of course, that's the chimney for downstairs and i would bet you there is room above this but take a look so right on market street my biggest concern was we're on market street not too bad right then you've got this closet that opens up traditionally it could have been a fainting room or whatnot but they've opened it up because there are doors 
and you have your full bathroom here. So it's en suite technically here. And then we've got that one. Let's go over towards the master side. The master side's really nice too. You've got big bathroom, dual vanities. You've got a jacuzzi shower over tub. Nice little skylight above. Nice little toilet there, nice little area. And it created a lot of storage for that. And you could always do lots of built-ins. We've seen that do, do well. And you've got another set of closets here. And over here, corner window. And then back up here, we're at back where we're above. You might remember we were downstairs earlier. Now we're up here again. Great view of Twin Peaks. You're kind of in the fog shadow. Um, we live down the block, like we said. And this is relatively sheltered. You can see Kite Hill from there. Peekaboo views around the way. Interestingly enough, these buildings go further back. So if for some reason, maybe you wanted to do some sort of expansion out back, it'd be more difficult, but it could be possible. Again, like we said, where there's a will, there's a way. Patience, time, money, and working with your neighbors is probably how you would handle that. Uh, again, skylight up here. This shows you that there's some room to go to. So if you want to add some lighting, maybe some height or whatnot. But again, it's pretty much moving ready now. I like this little staging area here sort of the kid getting kids ready, getting ready for the day or whatnot. And um, yeah, so coming down here, we are just on our way out. The property is listed with Four Bridges Group over at Carl Williams. And um, yeah, offer date is now on December 12th. And um, yeah, I think it's great. And yes, there is non-internal access, but you could probably make it so if you really wanted to all right well it's kevin ho signing off it's a great listing and um pretty surprising actually so uh great potential nicely done something you can live in and move in now but also something where you can improve um to your heart's content uh as well all right that's it